Hi, today we're going to learn how to make a CBD pain lotion using the Mighty Fast Herbal Infuser. To learn more about the Mighty Fast Herbal Infuser and for more recipes, visit theherbalinfuser.com. Now here's what we need. We're going to need a quarter cup of infused MCT or coconut oil, a quarter cup of cocoa butter, a quarter cup of shea butter, a quarter cup of light olive oil, and 10 to 20 drops of essential oils of your choice. The first step is going to be to infuse the CBD into our MCT or coconut oil. So of key importance is to start with high CBD herbs. Put those herbs into an oven safe dish, decarb, 250 degrees Fahrenheit in the oven for 25 minutes. Once it's decarb, we'll put the herbs into the hopper of the Mighty Fast Herbal Infuser, and then we'll add in our coconut oil or MCT oil. Either one would work for this recipe. And we're gonna choose the Mighty Fast two cycle. And in 90 minutes later, that's why they call it the Mighty Fast, we're gonna have our infusion completed and our CBD oil is infused. We're gonna pour that through the filter that's provided with the Mighty Fast Herbal Infuser, the hemp filter, and then squeeze that out using some gloves, squeeze out to refine it. And we'll, we'll have a lot more than what you'll need for this recipe, but then you'll be able to use that for lots of other recipes moving forward. Now, beginning with this recipe, the first thing is going to be to melt together all of our oils. I usually start with the cocoa butter with that because it's a lot thicker and it takes a lot longer to melt. So start with that in a double bill boiler or into a heat safe dish like that into a water bath. So we're going to avoid the direct heat. We then put in our shea butter, then we're going to add in our infused coconut oil as well as our olive oil. So once all four of our oils are combined together, we're going to let that melt together for about 25 minutes until it's all melted. And the next step is going to be to pour that melted oil all together carefully into a glass dish or into a heavy metal dish that's much larger than what you would think you would need, but we're going to blend that. And then we'll also add in our essential oils at this point. You could add in tea tree oil, mint, whatever kind of oils that you might want for your lotion, but be sure to remember you're putting it on your skin. Now we're going to chill that in the refrigerator just to thicken. That could just take 20 to 30 minutes. You can see our bowl is also very cold and that's going to help us to incorporate the air into it. So what we're doing now is we're using a hand mixer on high and you could use, also use a stand mixer if you want. And then we're going to whip air into it for several minutes and you just keep whipping it until it stops becoming more opaque. Maybe take 10 minutes. And at that point we're pretty much done. The last step is to pour it into your final containers and then to chill it overnight, to set it. And once you've let it set overnight and chill, then at room temperature like this, it's going to be a nice consistency oil that you'll be able to very easily rub on your skin for moisture and to relieve pain. For more recipes like this, please visit theherbalinfuser.com.